She's so cold, Elphino. The child is alert, and I see no wounds, and yet... <sighs> she grows weaker. My spells can do no more. What she needs is a change of clothes and a warm bed. We must hurry back. Not now! Matsya, take the child! It appears we've made enough noise to be heard for miles around. More will be upon us ere long. We make our stand here. Matya, can you take her back to the village? But the child? All, all by myself? You can't be serious! The beasts will follow you home unless we stop them here. And so we shall. Be strong, Matsya. Her life is in your hands. Right. I... I can do it. I know you can. We'll keep them busy, Matsya. Go! Quickly! Steady. You know the way. No. No. Not you too. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. To live is to suffer. To drink of calamity. It is a perilous path. Death lurks in the dark. No! I'm not afraid! I'm not afraid! Do not avert your eyes. See! See your life for what it is! See how the hardships make you strong, every doubt reforged. Every agony. <sighs> Divinity? Nay, but one who would deliver thee just the same. Please, you must save the child. She is all that remains of Mevan and Grasef. Please! Well, well. Seems the babe's taken a liking to you. Despite our friends as we flew in, they appeared to be holding their own against the Horde. 